whenever you're ready. This poem came out of a number of different occasions where people seem to think that being black and being Scottish is a contradiction in terms. So um, so things like that are always happening. Like very recently in, in week time I was with my mum and um, she referred to me as her daughter and this little old lady said, is that lady your daughter? My mum said yes and she went, oh, your daughter's awful tanned. Is she that colour every day? So, um, so I've had lots of instances of that kind of thing, so I thought I'd write this little poem, In My Country. In my country, walking by the waters, down where an honest river shakes hands with the sea, a woman walked round me in a slow, watchful circle, as if I were a superstition or the worst dregs of her imagination. So, when she finally spoke, her words spliced into bars of an old wheel, a segment of air. Where do you come from? Here, I said. Here. These parts. Somebody else. If I was not myself, I would be somebody else. But actually I am somebody else. I have been somebody else all my life. It's no laughing matter going about the place all the time, being somebody else. People mistake you. You mistake yourself. Darling, you might forget the exact sound of her voice or how her face looked when sleeping. You might forget the sound of her quiet weeping curled into the shape of a half moon when smaller than herself, she seemed already to be leaving before she left, when the blossom was on the trees and the sun was out and all seemed good in the world. I held her hand and sang a song from when I was a girl. Heal ya ho boys, let her go boys. And when I stopped singing, she'd slipped away, already a slip of a girl again, skipping off, her heart light, her face almost smiling. And what I didn't know or couldn't say then was that she hadn't really gone. The dead don't go till you do, loved ones. The dead are still here, holding our hands. <laughs>